The lights are low, the music is hot. It's another Friday night at World Cafe Live in Wilmington, one of the region's top concert venues. Well, hello, Wilmington, Delaware. <laughs> but to know how all this happened, we have to rewind the tape about seven hours. That's where we meet Mike. I'm Mike Abrams. I'm the production manager for World Cafe Live in Philadelphia and Wilmington. Abrams is the man behind the music, the dude with the details, the guy who makes sure everything lands in its right place. So I coordinate all of the technical details for each show. I coordinate the schedule for each show. I deal with artist hospitality. I maintain the audio, video, and lighting systems and uh, manage my crew. Tonight he's working a nine o'clock show for country music up-and-comer Ashley Monroe, which means around three, he and his crew are already hard at work. The artists will load in their equipment, you know, we'll help them push all the gear in. Uh, we'll build amplifiers and drum kits and set up microphones. We'll wire the stage with mic cable. We dial in the, the stage monitors, get rid of any feedback, um, and then set a house mix. With all that underway, Abrams throws on his host hat and tends to the people who matter most, the musicians. The artist has ultimate control over the show. Um, they can easily pull the plug for any reason. So we need to minimize what those reasons are. And if we can cut them off before they even happen, that's great. Artists' requests can be odd. One asked Abrams for a Christina Aguilera Christmas CD. Another wanted a unicorn. Abrams countered with a miniature pony. You need to be accommodating for the artist but also put your foot down about certain things. Um, you know, sometimes you just need to draw the line in the sand and say, this is how it's going to be, and we need to move past it. A lot of that stuff is negotiated in advance, often with a lot of back and forth. Tonight, though, the spread is simple. Some chips, cold cuts, and some much-needed booze. Then it's time for a quick rehearsal. This is Abrams' last chance to check for any glitches, and glitches do happen. It's part of the job. So too is keeping calm when those glitches arise. You need to always keep your composure. And if you don't tip off the artist that there's a problem, they'll never know, and the audience will never know. Because every night there's something weird that happens, and our goal is to make sure that nobody knows about it. And that really is the crux of Abrams' job. He's the quiet, zen-like problem solver at the center of this complicated enterprise. But as doors open around 7 p.m. and the crowd starts to buzz in anticipation, even he gets nervous, specifically at one critical moment. When the lights come down at the start of the show, it's the most exciting moment. Those are the most crucial seconds of the entire night, is unmuting all of your channels and making sure everything works and the lead vocals are cut, you know, cut through the, mi the mix. It's the most important part of the night. Tonight, that crucial moment passes without a hiccup. The show is off, the crowd is happy, and Abrams is somewhere off in the wings, nowhere to be seen.